And the way you tell that is you just kind of come down to the soil, you grab it. If it really sticks together and it's real shiny, that means there's too much moisture in it. It looks to me like we're borderline here, but I think it's okay. It's not too wet. I'm not wringing any moisture out. We'll be able to plant. One of the things that you want to be sure you do is kind of get rid of all the weeds and just sort of till the soil up. Now I'm using a, a spade. You could also use a mini rake in order to do this. This area gets a lot of sun and these particular plants love a lot of sun. I've been working this particular bed for nearly 10 years. So it, the soil is just terrific. I don't have to add very much in terms of nutrients. And of course, this is what I'm eating out of. So I'm trying not to use any chemicals at all. So what I've got here is just a little bit of leftover organic fertilizer from last year. Fertilizer really doesn't go bad. So I'm just going to take a little bit of this and sprinkle it in the soil. And then I've got these shallots here. Shallots are great. You know, shallots and onions, they're really easy to grow and you plant them almost exactly the same way. Unlike your bulbs that you plant in the fall, which you want completely buried, these particular guys you don't. You want the very tips of the bulb just barely showing. So you put these in. I want about six to eight inches between each bulb and I really, I'm kind of a stickler. I like these in very straight rows. Liquid potash, if you can find that, do that about every two weeks. That'll help these guys to really give them a, a nice good boost. You want about a foot between each row. So if I started another row over here, I'd do about a foot between those, plant those in, something like that. Again, about six to eight inches. They'll sprout in just a matter of a week or two, and then you just leave them, lots of sunshine, dry spells keep them watered. Otherwise, these are good to go, and I'm looking forward to uh, making some good shallots here in another few months. Thank <laughs> you.